This is an instructional video on how to install IPC and SCCM as well data I send you. To start, you'll need either an OBD Link MX or another OBD adapter with a switch so you can view all the buses. Start by plugging it into your OBD port. Go ahead and turn the car on. There's no, do not start the engine. And pull up your computer. Um, you'll need to now connect the uh, OBD adapter either via Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, or even USB. After you do the force scan, connect to the car. So if you've never connected before, you won't get this dialog. It will just take a very long time to go through and talk to everything. If you have an ELM with a switch, you'll need to flip the switch as Forescan tells you to. If you've connected before, you can reload like this, though sometimes I recommend just starting fresh. All right, after you do that, go ahead and go to this little icon down here of the computer chip. And we're going to go to click on IPC, Module Configuration, As Built Format. You're going to hit play. And then it's going to warn you, you're going to hit OK. If it says you need an extended license, you need to get an extended license. If you go to uh, the question mark here, it will say uh, copy your uh, hardware value. And you'll need to go search Google for Forescan Extended License. You just create an account on their website, and then you copy this hardware ID here, paste it there, and then you'll get your extended license. All right, once we're here, we're going to hit load all, and it's going to pop up these uh, values. The first thing I would do is save all just to be safe, and we'll call this old IPC, and OK. And now we're going to load all. So the file I give you will probably be in your downloads folder. So go to your downloads folder, wherever it is, and then you're going to choose the one that has your VIN and digital IPC.abt. OK, to load it, let me hit write all. It's going to ask, are you sure? We hit yes. Off and on, so we turn the ignition off. Turn it back on, and we'll hit OK. And now you're set on the IPC. So we'll hit the stop button in the bottom left, and then we'll go back on the top here, configuration and programming. Then we'll click SCCM module configuration as built format and the play button. Hit OK. And we'll hit save all. Old SCCM. OK. Load all. And we're going to load the VIN with 2018 SCCM. Hit OK. And we're going to write all. Yes. All right, turn the ignition off and back on. Hit OK. And you should be all set. If for some reason something doesn't work right or display right, let me know and we'll get it fixed.